All right, guys, here we are with another donation unboxing. This one comes from a good friend, Tristan, also known as RC Bros 2000. And he said this was a Christmas gift, which is freaking awesome. I wasn't expecting anything, but believe me, guys, I'm excited to open it up. He said it wasn't going to be much, but believe me, guys, any donation is always pretty darn freaking cool. It means a lot to me. And it's an awesome way to start off the new year. Happy New Year's to everyone. I really didn't get to make a video anytime lately, but let's go ahead and see what's in here. Oh, uh, yep. <laughs> Bring chaos to the world. Oh no, here we go. Let's go ahead, cut open another bag. Tristan's signature move. Woo! You know, I got it. Oh! <laughs> that is freaking awesome. I was kind of... Oh, guys. If you don't know what this is, these are the center drive lines that I've been needing for a very, very long time for Chaos. Oh, with these, I can finally get this RC up and running. Oh! Oh, gosh. Thank you so freaking much, Tristan. Guys, the price for these have ranged so much, and I was originally um, setting up to work with Kyo0976 to getting Chaos translated, or translated, turned into a double XL too, I believe. Yeah. And, um,. I asked him to get these for me a long time ago and just things never worked out and oh, all the money I spent getting him up to the state that he's in now, I mean, oh, I can finally get this RC up and running. Oh, I've got to install these immediately. Oh, which means I can finally get him up and running. That's so freaking cool. Thank you so much, man. Of course, we do have a letter. Page one. <laughs> Untitled. Aww. Dear Dark Ecliptic Heart, hey buddy, how have you been? I guess you can say things have been chaotic. Ha ha ha. Here we go. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. I know I'm probably late but about it, but I'm sending you a little Christmas present. Nothing big, but it's for someone huge. Yeah, my biggest RC is still today. And as you probably have guessed, those are the center drive shafts for chaos. One of them I opened just to make sure they were the correct ones. Sorry about that. You opened one? Eh, I can't tell. Ah, <laughs> uh, let me see. And you don't even have to apologize about it, dude. Believe me. Uh, where am I? Oh yeah, but now your giant RC will be more than just a decoration. I hope 2016 will be a better year for you, seeing after how 2015 has been. Yeah, oof, guys, these past two years for me have been... Hell. Yeah, hell. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I wanted to send this sooner, but I've just been busy with work. I just never got to do it. Or got to it. Well, I hope you're enjoying getting chaos running, and I'll talk to you next time we are both not busy. We've just been... Crazy lately. We've both been busy a lot. We gotta stop that. <laughs> P.S. Did you think I wasn't going to mention that cow thing again? Uh, <laughs> what you gets wrong? It's still burned into my brain. If any of the viewers are wondering about this cow thing, I keep mentioning this is what I have to say. Japan. Enough said. <laughs> Your friend Tristan. Obviously, Bros. 2000. Yeah, guys, the whole cow joke thing is... <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. This is so freaking cool, man. Thank you so much. Dude, you did open one. Well, since you already opened one, let me go ahead and check it out. Oh, gosh. Believe me, guys, I definitely need these. And the nice thing about them is that um, the old center drive lines for Chaos are in horrible shape, so... Believe me, this is not only something I need on uh, the fact that the other ones are too short, but I need them because I need to replace the part in general. So this is so freaking cool. All right, before I end this video, 
I just gotta see. <sighs> Chaos, my big boy. Gosh. Oh, crap. I forgot how heavy you are. Yeah. It's like a good 30 pound RC, guys. <laughs> you know, I get the feeling this thing is just as big as uh, the X Max that Trax has just released. And if you're guys wondering, no, I'm not going to be getting an X Max. That thing is way too expensive and out of my line. But there you go. Check it out. Oh. Such an easy installation. Now you guys can see I taped these up because they were hanging down. I couldn't roll the wheels. Oh, yes. Oh, I can't wait to get this RC all up and running. This is going to be such an easy installation because all I have to do is undo that grub screw, pull these out, and then put the new ones in. Um, I am going to make a video about it. And hopefully at the end of the video, I'll go ahead and show a quick little run video of Chaos running around. I am going to have to figure out if this fuel tank is going to work as well as I hope it does. The fuel line does uh, go in through the top, and it, since this is meant for an actual gas filter, since the other one didn't fit on here. Uh, sorry, battery died, but okay. Hi, Karama, the camera died again. All right, so we'll be quick. This is set up for a gas uh, fuel. All right, camera died a third time. Gotta charge those batteries all the way, guys. <laughs> Anyways, this fuel tank is made for gasoline, not nitro. So I don't know if this is gonna work very well with nitro. I might have to mod it so it can run with nitro. So we'll see how that all goes. But yes, thank you so so very much Tristan for this I mean oh I need to get these installed immediately 